we really had to approach looking at our courses in a very different way. And that's what I like about Ultra, that it forced me to take a step back and think, what needs to be in here and what are the manageable chunks that are going to be appropriate for my students. And then uh, start thinking about with Blackboard Ultra, how course content is organized on a weekly basis under a learning module because it is really a lot easier for students. I like the consistent format and the template that is built into it. It allows me to very easily navigate through and know how to best structure it. I know that I'm using the best evidence in teaching. I think my students have enjoyed this consistent appearance across courses so they know that their Begin Here module is going to start them off into a course where they can go back to find materials and items that are important for them as they complete assignments or access discussion boards. You can easily create a new chunk of content area and so that you can upload like a video or an interactive question. So like I've been embedding test the questions, which is really nice to do short formative style activities for students. They really enjoy being able to open the documents within Blackboard itself. So they don't have to download the document and open the document separately changing over from the Grade Center into the Grade Book. I really like the different views that you can look at the assignments and to provide feedback to some of the assignments is a little bit more clear and the layout is a lot nicer. Having the data analytics feature built into Blackboard has really given me the opportunity to connect with students on a deeper level and really give them more insight to how they're performing in the class at an up-to-date basis. We're using things like, you know, Flip, Panopto, Synchronous Office Hours, and Ultra really supports using all those tools so that we're able to still communicate with students. One of the features that we were pretty much begging to get was to actually be able to do accommodations, but individual accommodations, because it is very difficult when you have to make an accommodation and the whole class will be able to see that something in an assignment has changed so Blackboard Ultra gives me that option. I found that it was much easier to reimagine things than to try to make Blackboard Ultra do things the way they were in Blackboard Traditional. Once you're familiar with the operating system and how to work within it, it comes a little bit easier. But if you're open-minded and creative and think a little bit about how you can deliver that content in a new way, you're gonna be really pleasantly surprised.